<laughs> we got the fry man up there. I have not called for you, Frylock. What are you doing here? <laughs> Frylock? Well, quit hovering. <laughs> I am the leader. Man, your car is messed up. <laughs> Live here. How are you going to get to work, Carl? <laughs> I work out at a home. Frylock. <laughs> Okay, guys, we're going to watch a little Iron Mouse today. You know, she's been a uh, topic of conversation. She's been on people's minds because of that garbage she's having to go through with her VOD channel, you know, getting taken down. And I, I get completely where she's coming from. You you'd love to be able to file a counterclaim, but she doesn't want to give away her personal information, you know, her name or her address to some faceless individual or corporation or whatever, but... I've just always liked Iron Mouse from the time we first started watching the VTubers. Her singing voice, everything about her just seems like such a sweetheart. And I, I had this video recommended to me, Iron Mouse, on what people said about her real body. I got a feeling this might just make me angry because I it's probably not going to be nice things. I know she said in the past that she's really tiny. I don't know. Let, let, let's let, let's watch and find out. Just like what, And then people say stuff weird to me, and then it makes me think... Bro, that just makes you look weird that you're saying that. You know what I mean? Oh my god. Like, the amount of weird <laughs> comments and like it's the this game. Weird that people have said to me because I'm small. It's like mm. the height and oh, like SpongeBob. the body, like the height, like it just totally like fucks with people sometimes. I, I love her voice. To the point where it's like they say the most off hint. Like I literally had okay, like what? I had like two separate instances. One Someone was like, someone straight up told me, oh, you can never be sexy because you're small. You're I've always that. just going to be cute. Too. You will never be sexy. Mm -hmm. You will never be beautiful. You're Whoa. just so cute. That's asinine. I find that personally offensive considering that my wife is not quite five feet tall. She'll tell you, oh, no, I'm, I'm five foot. A little under. No. What the fuck? That doesn't even make any sense in any way, shape, or form. You can't be beautiful because you're short? Beauty doesn't have a height requirement. Okay, yeah, this, this is going to piss me. People are just douchebags for the sake of being douchebags. I really hate people sometimes. And I'm like, a lot of times. What the fuck? Yeah. <laughs> and then... I don't know. I'm not sure who she's talking to. Must be someone else who's on the shorter side. I had somebody straight up tell me that when they look at me and when they talk to me, they feel like a pedophile. And I was just like, oh, oh I've heard that too. Yeah. And I'm just like, do you know how weird like, that makes What? That's not... <laughs> uh, th okay, uh, you know that's asinine because isn't the, the common phrase little old lady? So... Um, uh, my wife, for example, she's a grandma now. So if a woman of short stature is into her 80s and she's four foot ten, you feel like a pedophile if you're going to speak to her because she's short? There are other characteristics that designate what a human is other than their height. <sighs> People. Stupid. Me? Garbage. Right. Like they That's just mean. So short and they're like child and I'm like, Whoa. Yeah, because they're like, you're so short Ew. and your voice is really high. That makes no sense. So these people accusing her, I, I'm sorry, I'm just pissed off, uh, or telling her that they feel like a pedo talking to her, I would be creeped out by those people. So if you're going to tell me that this person encounters a 13-year-old girl who is unusually tall, is that person okay with whatever? That gives me a shit. Yeah, th and, those and are people with some serious like, problems. Like an adult, and I'm just like, what? What are you oh. talking about? I mean, here's the other thing, though. Younger girls nowadays, just for, really for a while, they've all been, like, not looking their age. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Like, well, the makeup of, and, I think, yeah. I think young people not doing right with trying to look their age. And I think, like, there's nothing wrong with wanting to look a little older, wanting to look a little more mature, but... I see 16 year olds and younger out there with fleeky eyebrows. Yeah, you know? that's true. And like, and like they're wearing clothing that just doesn't feel, it just doesn't say teenager well, to me. I can tell you this, if I was a young man, if I was like in my early twenties or something on the dating scene, before I went out, did anything with anybody, be show me ID. Cause, cause she's right. You can't tell a lot of times that they the have, younger girls look really so much older. Up, like straight up, like they, they genuinely look yeah, good, but it, it's it'd be all... too mature, I think. <laughs> Yeah, and I think the lines between like like what ages are supposed before to be we even have a conversation. I, mean, I need to see your just, ID. I don't know, just like, <laughs> there's like a switch, like little kid, adult woman, and I think if you're not wearing like a bunch of makeup and looking like you're trying to look older, they think that automatically makes you look younger. 
Well, that's why, like, I started wearing right? makeup. That's too. fair. Because I wanted to look right. older, and yeah. I'm like, well, maybe you shouldn't have to do that for people other people. Like, take me more seriously, and mm -hmm. it was true. People took me more seriously when I had a more like mature yeah. looking makeup look on my face. Too bad that she deals with that. Work so that you know, people, I wouldn't walk into a room of people that like don't know me yet, and they wouldn't immediately treat me like like a kid, you know? Like, yeah. It, it, okay. It was like night and day. If I had makeup on, they just like I wouldn't. I still would look younger than I was, but not like that much younger you know what i mean so they wouldn't they wouldn't question it but um but if i like didn't wear much makeup or any at all they'd just be like "Ooh, who's this sassy i don't child? think though yeah. it's <laughs> i mean i've seen respect you at the we've seen all seen level. women who are small i mean yeah. it doesn't I take much conversation to learn like, that they're a, like people just or feel like they're adults because like you just want people to, <laughs> to treat you normal but mm -hmm. it's like you're always cute. Know. You're like they treat you like a kid. Mm -hmm. They treat you cute, and then they act weird. Give you yeah, head pats, do they? they <laughs> Probably, weird. huh? They just act <laughs> weird. Yeah, I can't. Mm -hmm. I can't describe the way people act, but it's just weird. That's. It's just, it kills it because it's funny. I've told you guys before with these. Uh, uh, with these VTubers, I get such a paternal feeling towards them because they they entertain me. I, I really like them. I enjoy them. I think they're cute and humorous and. Again, they're all way, way younger than me. Not kids, but way, way younger than me. So I get those paternal feelings. So when I hear her talking about people doing shitty things to her, it actually oh, gets me say. all oh, infuriated. I want to punch somebody in the face. Pick you guys up. I, have I short spend a lot of my time wanting to punch somebody in the face. They think they're allowed to touch you because you're short. They, they think they're allowed to pick you up. They're allowed to like touch oh. you. Oh. Asking permission. Yeah. And never touch somebody's head. You don't walk That's up to somebody. That's creepy. Imagine someone she, your height or taller. You she, walk up and put your hand on their head. Nobody oh. does. That. I was kidding. Look, but if you're shorter, they you're really like, do that. Like, reaching for it, and I'm like, whoa. I've had that people. Just gross, you know? That's, that's fucked up. Like, I was that was a joke. <laughs> I didn't think they really <laughs> dealt with that. I think, I think <laughs> oh Jesus. <laughs> because people people oh. would like tower over me oh. and they were like cabadon me oh. and I'd be like, yeah. without no prompting, no asking, it was just I'm it was just like, my enemies. Yeah, that's. Yeah, yeah. It's weird. You know, I, I, I couldn't stand it. Like, this face looking at us, though, so <laughs> while we're watching this. Case, but sometimes, guys who were shorter would treat me like I was their only hope. You know what I mean? You ever, like, stand around in a group? <laughs> oh, that's terrible. Oh you ever yes. stand in a, around in a group? There's a bunch we of have dudes and one's really short. Society immediately magnetized to the shortest has enough there. ways so to separate us all into categories. We have to do it by height, to too? Do that. Yes. You know what I mean? And oh I'm like, Jesus God, Christ! Do that to some person. You, you could, you could express it. You could be like, it's kind of nice because I'm short and I don't see it often. You could say that and it would be totally fine. But they never say it like that. They never you know say I mean? it like that. They always make it seem like mm -hmm. not wow. like something else, and it's just like, come on, man. Mm -hmm. Like, what yeah. the? And like, I would never have a problem with them having been short if they didn't do that. <laughs> and now right? Yeah, and, but that gives you a prejudice. <laughs> yeah, like yeah, yeah. I don't like it, and I don't want it. So leave me. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure it was so, weird, man. so freaking cute. Yeah, you just, you just, it, it, it just gets to the point where it's like you don't know how to act and you don't know what to do. Because yeah, you have to feel awkward all the time through no so fault of your own. You. And it's because they just don't know how to act around people of your stature. They just don't. I think I people do this with anyone who's different. True. Anything is different. I think that's and true. You need to like outwardly I think that's notice true. it. But you're like so short. Or they just automatically oh, put no, their dude, arm on your head up. all the time. I, I I am not I'm not a touchy person, dude. If someone does that to me, it's it's like yeah. I, I have, well, that's I take it as a pass to do whatever I need to do to make that person stop. No, you're know? you're, you're 100 percent right. No matter the situation, people, people don't have a right to come up and put hands on you. Yeah. Latin people, Latino people, like we we are touchy people. Everybody is touchy. Mm -hmm. I'm touchy. gregarious like too, that. but but I. I'm, I'm not saying I don't but like it, within but reason I don't like it without permission. people that you know what I mean? yeah I'm if comfortable I with you if you're my friend sure it's fine we could be whatever but if I don't know you and if I'm not comfortable or close to you what gives you the right to do that to me you know what I mean it's like I wouldn't do that shit yeah to you. I, I, I could see especially because she's little people are just gonna feel like it's their place being small god damn like they automatically it automatically gives them a pass to like treat me like a stuffed animal or like <laughs> Sort of like oh, that's or cute though. Or something. And it's just like, Jesus Christ. Like, yeah. Do not put your hand on my head. I am not 
a, a armrest, you know. <laughs> I'm not an armrest. So good. That's you're good. You're Latina <laughs> and you're around like people like that are very mm. open to like touching and stuff. They're like, damn, what's wrong with you? What the? F you're so f***ing rude. Yeah. Blah, 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 blah. And it's like. They yeah, you're rude. Because like, you want somebody oh, laying on you. your cousin or like whatever. And I'm like, that's. Uh, no. It doesn't work like that. Yeah, so it gets to a point where it's like that keeps on happening. So I just don't say anything. I'm like, haha, yeah, yeah. But no. inside, I'm like, so you get, yeah, you yeah, get yeah, browbeaten like into bad, submission. Bad thing to build up in someone. That's too right? bad. Like, make them habitually like not not act upon feeling uncomfortable, right? Yeah, yeah it sucks like that, that to go people should learn to be like, out and about and feel themselves. And if you, awkward if you through no fault science, of your own. You know, whatever. It's, oh, your grandma, it's your grandpa, you know, whatever. Well, it just it just reinforces them not advocating for themselves when they're in other situations later. Well, you know, hmm. I have to be nice because, you know. <laughs> I have to be nice because, you know, <laughs> I don't have to be nice. That, yeah, that's actually... That's unsettling. That that's sad. I mean, we we all know that Iron Mouse has health issues and stuff like that. So on top of all that, you have to deal with just because of your stature, feeling uncomfortable, just existing. <laughs> that sucks. Okay, th this just pissed me off. I'm gonna go out and find somebody doing that to a short person and punch them. Why watch the news? I'll be on it. <laughs> <laughs> There's a brook move. Checking to see if you had a tail. See the panties. <laughs> oh, don't worry. Maybe it just takes girls longer to grow theirs. <laughs> I'm sure yeah, that's what it is. 